Hey guys, I am so excited. I am in my new room. So my mom's basement flooded. So we had to redo the basement, like the carpet and everything. We redid the walls as well. So now everything is done and I'm back in here. I love the back drop of it because it looks gray kind of, but it is more of a creamy gray, I guess. Overall, I just have a lot more space in here and I'm excited to bring to you great content for 2019. So this video, I am going to be showing you a super simple eye look from the James Charles Times Morphe palette. Also, please like and subscribe down below. So, let's get started. Okay, so I don't know any of the shade names because it doesn't come below the thing. That's one thing I don't like about this palette. And I have no idea where that one shoot went with it. So I will be showing you what shades I use though for sure. I'm going to go into this shade up here. I'm going to use this all over the lid. Now I'm going to go into the shade right below it and start putting some colors into the crease. With the same brush, I'm going to go into this yellow right here. Next shade I'm going to go into is the one right here, that darker brown. Okay, I'm going to switch brushes to a more dense one and go into the same color. Just deepen that into the crease a little more. Okay, so with the same brush, I'm going to go even deeper into this one right here, the more mauve color on top, and then I'm also going to go into this one after. Okay, so now the darker shade. The bigger circle one. There. So now I'm done with the crease colors. I'm going to go into this super dark brownish mauve color and do that for the outer crease. And then what I usually do is go back into this crease shade color that I have left over and kind of just blend it all together. So now I'm ready to do the lid shade and I'm going to do this super pretty crap. I can't decide. Should I do this one or the nice orange? I'm going to do pink. That was a hard decision. And look how pigmented that is. I always apply it with my finger because that's the biggest payoff I've gotten. And you can also use Fix Plus, but that takes a lot of extra work. Okay, so now let's do the lower lash line really quick. Then I will jump off camera, put lipstick on, and my eyeliner, lashes, and mascara. So then I can show you the final look. But as you can tell and see, it really doesn't take that long. The way I do it, I feel like, I don't know. It is not because I'm really good at makeup. It's just, I don't know. I feel like I found the best way to do it as quickly as possible so I can do a nice pretty look and head out the door. All right, so I'm gonna start off with, okay, so I'm gonna start with this color right here. Guys, I need to think of a better way to show you what shades I'm using. I want to put like the full palette on the screen and then circle which one, but I don't know how to do that on iMovie or my editing apps. So stay tuned for that. Um, but overall, I'm gonna be using this one and then go into this one. And that's probably the darkest I will get in my lower lash line. <music> Okay, 
Okay, so I think I might want to make it a little darker. So I will go lightly, lightly into the darkest shade I used for the outer corner. Okay, so there's my eye look. So let me go off camera, put on my lashes, and everything else I said earlier, and I'll be right back. Okay guys, so I'm done. Here is the final look. And I think it turned out really, really pretty. And as you saw, it really wasn't much steps, and it was super, super simple. So, here is the look. I think it turned out really well, like I said, and you could easily do this at home without the James Charles palette, but I just wanted to show you a super simple, like, natural look that you could do with this palette. Please comment down below any other eye looks you want to see. I did do a super cool, like, colorful look like he did. I copied his video. I will show you a picture right above and then that link will be down below to watch that video because that is already up. It is filmed with my older camera so the quality isn't as good as this one. I want to do some more colorful looks as well so stay tuned for that. I hope you guys like watching. Please like and subscribe this video and I will see you guys later. Bye guys!